Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy, back with another crazy camp, and this time we're checking out Anna Saltron's build, which is the friggin' Normandy from Mass Effect, or at least as close as you're gonna get, given our camp budget and the building pieces we have, so overall pretty darn good. Also, uh, the gamer tag, Anna Saltron really makes me think some thought was put into this and that during like a PvP game when uh, you would kill somebody it would pop up a message and be like you were killed by Anna Saltron or Anna Saltron killed you which is brilliant now this is a video submission so we are seeing everything through the eyes of the builder and I'm gonna be honest I totally get having trouble finding like an interact spot when you turn off your HUD. It can be a pain sometimes, especially if it's just one little spot that'll let you interact. It can definitely be a bit challenging. Now inside the back here, we're about to feature a really nice habit. Look at this. Closing doors. Not enough people do it. So back here, Look up, kind of get an idea something's going on up there. And apparently, if you jump up here, we may get to a cozy little bedroom area. And work our way back down. This is really cool right here, alright? So we go into a shelter, and now the shelter is the interior of the ship. So that gets to save a ton of budget when building in that the camp itself. Plus, you're getting a really nice use out of a shelter. Off on this side, got a little bunk room set up. Pretty sweet. And then to the opposite side, we get a, you know, showcase one of Bethesda's uh, problems, which is doors that appear to be closed that are actually open. Like, oh my gosh, it, that annoys me so much when I'm walking through a camp. And I'm like, oh, well, let me open this. Oh, wait, it was already open, but I couldn't see it was open. But up here we got the bridge area, which I, I love the idea that part of what was built on the outside is now built in a shelter and then fully decorated within the shelter and it looks freaking awesome. I, I love like that you can look out and you got like the star wallpaper. You got some asteroids out there. I mean, it's, it's a brilliant use combining your camp and your shelter into one thing. I've only really seen a, a couple camps that fully took advantage of that and like maintained a really unique theme between them. And then, you know, getting to interact with it, that, that's also pretty freaking cool. I, I gotta say, this is one of those... one of those crazy, crazy camps. You know, they, they just seem to check off a few boxes that some other camps uh, just kind of miss. But that's going to wrap up the tour of this one. Huge thank you to Anna Saltron for letting me share this with all of you. If you've got a crazy camp you want to share, hop down in the comments. Let me know. I hope you've enjoyed it. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later.